Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to Amazed by the Quran, a series in which I try to share with you things I find incredible about the Quran. Today, inshallah, continuing the conversation about different kinds of plurals. A quick recap first. In Arabic, you can, uh, you can have a regular plural and then you can have a powerful plural. So they have weaker and stronger plurals. We don't have that concept in English. Books is just books, cars is just cars. But in Arabic, you can have one word for a few cars and yet another word for many cars. They can actually do that in Arabic, okay? Now this plays out in the Qur'an very interestingly. The example I want to share with you today is about uh, the assumption of some people from the Israelites who believe that even if they ended up in the fire, that will not, they will not end up there except for limited numbers of days. Ayyama ma'duda. Ayyama ma'duda means just a few days. But actually in one case, in Baqarah, Allah says ayyama ma'duda, counted days or limited days. Uh, and in Ali Imran, the same language comes up but it's slightly different ayyama ma'dudat uh, ayyama ma'duda in baqara ayyama ma'dudat in ali imran and they, they seem almost identical but actually from a language perspective they're different the the one in baqara the one in the earlier surah is actually a stronger plural and the one in ali imran is actually it's jama' mu'annath salim which basically suggests that it's a weaker plural in other words in one passage the israelites are saying we're going to stay a few days they may be a little more though and in the other passage, they're saying we're only going to save very, very few days. So in other words, one pace they said it's not that few. Maybe, maybe it'll be a long weekend or something. So they're, they're worried about extra time. Okay? And in the other, they're less worried. This is the power of Qur'an's contextualization. What Allah does is there are certain passages where certain things are highlighted more than others. So both Ali Imran and Baqarah, they both talk about the people of the book and they both highlight crimes that they've committed. But if you compare them, the people of the book mentioned in Baqarah com commit far more crimes. And the cr list of crimes mentioned in Ali Imran is much, much shorter. The, the passage in which the crimes are many, many more, when it came to concern about being in the fire, they said maybe it'll be a few extra days, I think. <laughs> so they made it a few extra. And the passage in which there's a few crimes mentioned, they're actually more relieved and say, no, it's going to be just a few days. It's not going to be that long. <laughs> Subhanallah. Like Allah captures just the subtlety in the plural. See, this is not going to show up in translation. But just the subtlety between the, the mufrad being used, the ayyama ma'duda being used, ayyama ma'dudat being used, is captured in the Quran so, per so perfectly. Subhanallah. So this is... And inshallah, in the next couple of episodes, I'll just highlight these kinds of subtleties of how Allah captures down to the word exactly what needs to be described and what sentiment people have. Because this is not just a matter of language now, it's actually also a matter of psychology. Somebody's willing to admit that they're wrong, but if you make the if you elaborate what their crimes are, then maybe they're able to they're they're willing to go a step further and say, okay, maybe I was a big deal. <laughs> And if you don't elaborate it as much, they're like, oh, come on, it's not so bad. I'm all right, you know. Like this, it didn't have to be said separately. This, this psychological phenomenon didn't have to be described separately. It was just embedded in two words and how they're transitioned from each other. Subhanallah. May Allah Azza wa Jal give us the ability to reflect and benefit from, the word, from His word. Barakallahu li wa lakum. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. If you enjoyed this video, please do share it with friends and family. If you want to see more videos from this series, click on the box at the top. If you want to see other videos, click on the box at the bottom. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thanks.